This is God's planet and by damaging it in the way we are, we are sinning against God. That was the message from the stage at Durban's main rugby stadium on the eve of COP17. It was a message shared by Christians, Jews, Muslims, Hindus and more. Nobody sings it more harmoniously than Lady Smith Black Mombasa or speaks it more graciously than Archbishop Desmond Tutu. It seems that the message is, we have faith. This is the message to the delegates, the politicians, the decision makers gathering in, in uh, Durban. We have faith that you will act on climate justice and that you will act now. Climate change is horribly real and we have caused it. If we don't act urgently, millions will suffer, especially here in Africa. So we, people of faith, and all concerned people have come together to communicate our message to world leaders as they gather for these critically important climate talks. Starting from tomorrow, governments and NGOs will be gathering leaders from all over the world. But do you know where the power is? The power is here with us, we the people. We choose the action to protect our earth. Tragically, not all have chosen this action and we ask the state parties, the negotiators for the COP17 firstly to be reminded of the, where they are coming from and to be faithful to the integrity of the creation. I am, I am